Create a new user. To create a new user in Sage50 accounts, log into the software using an administrator user login or manager login details. From the settings menu, select user management and click users. Now click the new button. Firstly, select the required user type. In this example, we will create a user requiring administrator access. The administrator user type has full access to company data and can perform most user management functions. Select the user type and click continue. Each person using the software must have a username. Usernames are alphanumeric and can include spaces. Please note passwords aren't case sensitive. If you want the user to change their password the next time they log on to this company, select this checkbox. Finally, add a password to a username. Click continue. If your data is shared using remote data access and you want this user to access this company remotely, click allow remote data access, then complete their user details. Click continue. Check the user summary details are correct and click save. Your new administrator user type appears in the list. To create an additional user, click new. Select the standard user type, then click continue. Now enter a username. Passwords are optional for both standard and read-only user types. If a password is not required, select this checkbox and click continue. If you want the user to change their password next time they log on to this company, select this checkbox. Finally, add a password to a username to provide extra security and then click continue. Access levels can be amended for each user type, except administrators, who have full access by default. When creating any other user type, you can allow or restrict access to the areas required. Select the areas that you want the user to be able to access. Note this may be quicker to select all and then start to remove the areas that the user does not need access to. These can be amended at any time. Once complete, click continue. If your data is shared using remote data access and you want this user to access this company remotely, click allow remote data access then complete the user details. Click continue. Check the user summary details are correct then click save.